what has been helpful for me to pitching to major brands like Visa and LV and Google over the years has been knowing what I'm selling and knowing if they're buying what I'm selling. And the only way that you can do that is by doing some research ahead of time and then literally asking them the question. And so one of my most important questions that I ask them is what does success look like to you at the end of a partnership? It's a question that they don't usually get asked. So it's not can, not media trained. You'll get the most honest answer possible. And they'll tell you what success looks like. Why is that important? Because if you go in thinking that success looks like moving a thousand people and they tell you success only looks like moving a hundred people, then not only can you manage that, but then you can also talk about every time you've hit it out the park, exceeding the 100 people that they say success looks like to them. It also makes sure that you are pitching directly what they need in what you can also offer. And a lot of times people are pitching the right thing. They're saying the right things, but it's the wrong connection to the needs or the problems that are keeping that person up at night. Oftentimes people will say, give me your elevator pitch. You never have to do an elevator pitch. Say, before I give you the elevator pitch, let me ask you a question. Take control back of the conversation, take control of the pitch. And then more than anything, it's a conversation. So build the relationship first and not the transaction.